A New York woman is suing two hospitals after she claims her husband was wrongly pronounced dead, twice. Tammy, Cleveland has filed a malpractice lawsuit claiming that her husband Michael E. Cleveland might have survived had the doctor responded more promptly rather than insisting he was dead. Cleveland was initially declared dead in the ER after he suffered a heart attack but showed signs of life. When a coroner entered his hospital room, his widow Tammy claims in a lawsuit. The doctor reassured her and her family that he was in fact dead and had a lot of energy to expel from his body, until almost two hours later when he entered the room a fourth time, and he found Mr. Cleveland's pulse, the lawsuit says. The suit details Cleveland was taken to another Buffalo hospital overnight for further care, but died later in the morning due to a collapsed lung, not by the health repercussions caused by the earlier heart attack. The case alleges a doctor at the second hospital told Mrs. Cleveland her husband may have survived if his impaired lung had been treated sooner. The family is seeking damages from both doctors and hospitals, according to the core documents.